Hello, hockey skaters and goalies around the world, and welcome to another edition of The Ride to the Rink, your little five-minute podcast on your way to the rink that you can listen to to get some motivation. One of the questions we get a lot over here at Ride to the Rink is about leadership and captaincy. Uh, and today we have a clip here from an NHL captain, a former NHL captain, who we uh, revere here, Rick Nash, who was a captain of the Columbus Blue Jackets. He also played for the New York Rangers, was a really great player in his era. And he talks a bit about leadership and what it means to him both staying true to yourself and why when you get the captaincy or you're honored with the C, it should never change who you are. It's something that you earn along the way by who you are. And if you need to wear the C, you probably don't deserve it. It's something that you need to earn and something, again, that he says you need to be true to yourself. So here's Rick Nash talking a little bit about captaincy on the ride to the rink. There's there's no one right way to lead. I think um, every every individual has their own way to uh, to lead. And I had some pretty cool captains through the years, um, Ray Whitney, Luke Richardson, Adam Foote, um, you know, guys that I could uh, I could learn from. And for me, when I first got the, the captain, I thought it was important that I didn't change. I think that people and humans are too smart to, uh, and they'll see through that. So if I, if I get a letter on my shirt, which is, which is just a letter, and I start coming in and throwing Gatorade bottles and calling guys out. Well, I'm not staying true to myself and I'm not respecting the person who, who got the letter on his jersey. So um, I tried to I tried to stay the same. But at the same time, now you're you're managing 25 different personalities. And you guys obviously know this. Um, some guys uh, need a fire lit up under their butt and some guys need to be coddled. Some guys need to be, um, you know, positive, positive feedback, positive reinforcement. So that was kind of the tricky part was understanding which, uh, what each player needed as an individual and for me to, to deliver that to them. And during all that, one thing never changed for me was I had to lead by example on the ice. I always thought, and Ken Hitchcock used to, used to tell me this, he said, if you go, they will follow you. So I knew that every night I had you know, 24 guys watching me to see how I was going to show up. So I had to go and I had to get these guys to, uh, to follow me. Um, so it, it's, it, it's a, it's a tricky, it's a tricky part, but I, I think you have to stay true to yourself to be a good leader. All right. Great stuff there from Rick Nash. And again, if you're not quite sure who you are yet at this point in your life, that's okay too. Part of the journey is discovering things about yourself and who you are and turning into the leader that you want to be. So if that's something you aspire to do, remember to be a great person. Remember about your integrity, what you do when no one's watching kind of makes you who you are. And those are some great pieces of advice from Rick Nash. This podcast came from Win Championship Trades for Life via Pivotal Moments Media. You can listen to that podcast and all the episodes with a lot of professional athletes on any podcast network you want. Again, it's called Win Championship Trades for Life or check it out at pivotalmomentsmedia.com. But that's going to do it for this edition of Ride to the Rink. Again, if you want more episodes like this, check out Our Kids Play Hockey, the podcast network we have everywhere where podcasts can be heard or our website, ourkidsplayhockey.com. Make it a great skate today. We'll talk to you soon. Take care.